<laughs> Do you have daddy issues? <laughs> Damn it. Can I have this one? <laughs> Hi, you two. How do you know each other? I'm Leah, and this is my dad, Marcus. Because we're in a pandemic, we have plexiglass in between you two. How do you feel about that? Yeah, it feels like home. <laughs> <laughs> when did you go to prison? I fell under the first set of mandatory minimum drug laws in uh, 1991. I was 18 years old, and when I was getting sentenced, I was on the phone with her mother when her water broke on October 13th. Leah, do you want to go first? Sure. Okay. First question. Why did you go to prison? Why did I go to prison? Because I broke the law. Can you like elaborate more on, on what you mean by that? Like, like what happened? It was the Contra scandal. The flow of drugs came through Mexico, up through California, and then by the time it got up here, we were so infatuated with something so different and got involved in it. I made some bad choices with no positive influencers there to, you know, help guide my decision making. Oh man, do you have, uh, do you have commitment issues because of me? I do have commitment issues and I, I honestly couldn't answer that if it's from you or not. I don't, I, I, I don't know. I'm gonna take a shot over that because. How did you meet my mom and did you find her sexy? This is kind of bizarre. I met your mother when I was 16, and as soon as I seen her, I just knew I, I wanted to be around her. And I was nervous as hell. <laughs> and um, she was too. And, and you know, there was something pure in that. That's why I always say you were genuinely made out of love. You know? Did you ask him if you were a mistake? <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to know, was I a mistake? <laughs> <laughs> um, there are no accidents. Come on, be real. Shit, that was real as it gets. I, I told was you a mistake. I love you. I was a mistake. No, I think the mistake was thinking we could use a child to find love. But you, not a mistake. Has family ever spoken ill of, <laughs> of me? Did you come to my defense? I mean, that's not even a real question. How could you? Can I will we skip this? I don't like that one because that's that's so. That's so unfair to her. We don't have to I'll war. I'll answer it. What I was told was that um, he didn't care. Um, <laughs> you know, was he was shit. You know, he went to prison on the day that I was born, but that was by choice and that he didn't want, he chose to not be there. That hurts. <laughs> I never would have thought that I would be framed in such a negative light. This kind of makes you want to drink. My <laughs> face is high. <laughs> Hell. <laughs> Since you missed giving me the talk, oh God. What talk? The talk. This one? <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Now is your opportunity. Do it or take a shot. Please take a shot. What would your sex talk have been like? I, I wouldn't have had a talk with her. I would have modeled it. No, that sounded kind of weird. Yeah. <laughs> Having good relationships and understanding how a respectful man would act. Next oh. question. Do you have daddy issues? <laughs> this is a bad question. Yes, I do. What's your issue? I'm like notorious for like putting a face on and putting, like shielding everything. I don't show people my emotions. Mm -hmm. So I just handle it myself, which explains the severe anxiety, you know, so. Wow, that's great. Do you think your sentence was deserved? No. Uh, it wasn't deserved. Why are we criminalizing people with um, um, addiction issues? That's, that, that's a health issue. It's, it's just mendacious. It's a deep-seated lie who a few benefit from, and then people are just, their lives are ruined. I don't like talking about that because I, I have strong views on that. Real strong views. <laughs> why did you accept, why did you accept me into your life? I didn't get out of Pelican Bay. <laughs> I, I was a murderer. I guess just wanting to know more. I just, I don't know. I That's just wanted a sense of validation of who I am. Did you get it? No, because you're weird. <laughs> well, I don't have orange hair. But shut up. Oh, man. Who comes up with these questions? 
Does your mother approve of us having a, a relation? Oh, man. <laughs> no, she doesn't. But I'm fine with that because at the end of the day, it's me and your relationship. What's one moment you wish we could have experienced together? I, I don't. I, I think all the moments we shared have been so monumental. I think it's just like dope. <laughs> Stop, know, it. So. Stop it. Stop <laughs> it. <laughs> but for real, right? Yeah. Don't do it. You I got, promised got, myself got I wasn't going to cry. I'm not going to do it. You got one right there. It's like, I got my game hang, face you on. Got her. on her. <laughs> Have you ever felt anger towards me? With us being not connected, no. But as we've connected, there's certain things that you've done that, that have angered you? me and annoyed me. I mean, can I you give me an example so I can have a learning moment? First here? of all, you talk oh. too much. <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, you aren't. I'm not. I'm not kidding. <laughs> That's cold. Mm. I don't like this question. No, I didn't do it. <laughs> it wasn't me. Uh, mm -hmm. Do you love me? I adore you. Yeah, That's of so course. Weird. That makes me feel weird. Why like, is that weird? I'm the most awkward person with love. So the challenge is, Leah, can you say I love you? Ooh. I mean, honestly, no. <laughs> oh. oh, it's okay, Mom. <laughs> Don't pressure her. Thank you. Was this interesting? Very awkward. Interesting. Good. <laughs> I don't know why she wanted to do it with the world. I'm still confused by that because she would not talk to me about, you know, I think it was a bold artistic expression though. Are you too glad you're in each other's lives right now? <laughs> yes. <laughs> too glad. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, it moves. <laughs> Put that on there. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs>